Hi everyone, welcome to DD Economics Tutor. In this video, we are going to learn about the total product, marginal product, and the average product. TP, AP, MP definitions, and the definitions we use are the terms that is the fixed factors and the variable factors. So, fixed factor is the fixed and the factors are fixed. What changes are Suppose the quantity cannot be changed in the short run. The quantity is the same. Example, building, plant, machinery. So, cost of fixed factors do not vary directly with output. So, these do not change. Whether the level of output increase or decrease or become zero. This change is the fixed factor. That is the change in the variable factor. That is the change in the short run. Whose quantity can be changed in the short run. Example, the raw material, transport, communication, casual labors. So, this is the change. That is the increase in the output. Decrease in the output. Decrease in the output. And zero is the output. Zero is the output. This is the variable factor and fixed factor. Now, what is TP? That is total product. Now, what is TP? Total product is a total output of commodity at a particular level of variable factor combined with a fixed factor. Variable factor or fixed factor or combined pani or output could occur than total product. So, in a simple word, it's a quantity of good produced by the firm during a given period of time with the help of given inputs. In the inputs are go, and the inputs are which we produce that is total product. So, that is one variable that is one of the fixed factors. So, total product is formula formula summation of MP. MP is marginal product. So, in our formula we use formula that is TP equal to AP into Q. Q is the quantity. So, next to average product. Average product is its output per unit of variable input output adha inna product irukudho or unit ku variable input ivula irukku abindra dhan solradhu adhavadhu ap equal to tp by units of variable factor average product endra the total product evlavo and the total product vande units evlo units neenga divide panningalo adhu vande average product ah irukum that is total product by the quantity of variable factor idhu da average product namba eduthukrom Next is the marginal product. Marginal product is a change in total product or output per unit of change in variable input. Every change is there. If you have a product, every change is there. If you have a unit, if you have a unit, if you have a additional input, if you have a additional output, if you have a change, it is a marginal product. That is the total product or output per unit of change in variable input. So while keeping the other inputs, factors are fixed. So if you have input change, the output will change. So you can find out what is the marginal product. Marginal product is the formula of Tpn minus Tpn minus 1. In our formula, we use the change in Tp divided by change in quantity. If you change in the triangle shape, it is delta and pair. So you have a numerical sum that is calculate AP and MP from the following schedule. In the formula which you need to substitute, the values you will get. Now, you can get Tp and you can get Tpn minus Tpn minus 1. That is the second value, the first value will minus 1. We will answer the answer. Ap, you can get Tp divided by unit, number of units. Ap, the value is 28, number of units is 4. So, you will get 7. So, next part is one question what time could there can that is TP is a summation of dash. The answer is MP. I hope you all understand the concept of AP, MP and TP. Thanks for watching. Share and subscribe my channel. Thank you.